Think of it this way. Roughly 7 million years ago, give or take a million years, there was a single population of apes living somewhere in Africa. This ancient ape was neither a modern chimpanzee nor a modern human, but a species that was ancestral to both. Then, for reasons likely tied to environmental changes, perhaps a shift in climate that fragmented forests and created new savannas, that single population split. One bunch, one branch of that family tree stayed primarily in the dense forests, continuing to climb trees and feast on fruit. Over millions of years, that lineage eventually led to modern chimpanzees and bonobos. The other branch ventured out into the emerging savannas, experimenting with walking upright, sweating more efficiently, and eventually, for better or worse, arguing on the internet. That lineage led us to Homo sapiens. Both branches are still here, still thriving in their own ways. So asking why are there still monkeys, or why are there still chimps if we evolved from them, is exactly like asking, if I came from my cousin, why is my cousin still alive? You didn't come from your cousin, did you? You and your cousin share grandparents. You both descended from those grandparents, but you took different paths, started your own families, and here you both are, still very much alive. So replace grandparents with common ancestor, replace family reunion with ancient African forest, and the whole thing stops sounding impossible. It actually starts making perfect sense. 